Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. It's Norman Nisa, and today we have got something really exciting for you. We will be diving into Flutter to create a stunning user interface effect that uh, will surely enhance the wow vector of your applications. So, without further wasting time, let's jump right into it. Alright, so here we have a Flutter project created. I have already designed a basic and simple login screen using uh, the column widget and inside the column widget I have the two welcome messages which I have just used the text widget here and I have just styled this according to my uh, theme basically. So and next we I have just used a form and inside that form I have just used two text form field one for email and the other one for the password and the last I have used a simple container uh, for the sign in button which I have used two colors which I have used the property uh, of my box decoration which is inside the container I have just used the gradient color for my button and that's it now we will be just uh, creating a background blurry effect for our application so let's just do that so we just need to uh, wrap our this padding widget with a stack widget to just add a background image or background color into it so for that I will be just wrapping my this padding widget with the stack widget here so I'll be just changing it to a stack and that's it so now I will be just adding some kind of containers here and then I will be just making them blur so here I'll be just creating and using the alignment widget align widget sorry and inside this align align widget I'll be just using the alignment property and I will be just adding it uh, adding some kind of boxes on my screen so on the top center I will be just adding a container which will be the container and I'll be just giving it a height and a width so I'll be just uh, using my media query to give it a height so which will be of context dot size dot height and I will just divide it it with 1.3 and I'll be just copying and pasting it for my width and I'll be just giving it the width and now I just need uh, to shape my this container to the circle and I just need to give it a color so for that I will be just using my decoration property which will be the box decoration property and inside this I will be just using the shape property and to the circle shape dot circle and I will be just coloring it basically so the, I will be using the color property which will be colors dot deep purple and that's it now I will be just saving this and you will see a circle uh, on the center of the screen so I will be just copying and pasting uh, this alignment widget and I'll be just adding some more circles on my this interface here you go now I'll be just changing uh, the alignment to top left and I'll be changing the color to which will be deep orange and this time it will be top right and I'll be just changing the color to yellow accent and I'll be just making this bottom uh, uh, bottom center and I'll be just letting the color as it is for the last one and I'll be just saving this and you will see some and as you see we have added multiple circles with vibrant colors to create a visually appealing background uh, the the alignment are carefully set to achieve effect now let's talk about the main part the blur effect 
we will be using backdrop filter widget with the blur property the sigma hex and the sigma y values determine the intensity of the blur effect you can play around with these values to get the desired level of blur before we continue if you are finding this tutorial helpful make sure to hit that subscribe button and ring the bell icon to stay updated with our latest plotter tutorials your support means a lot and it keeps us motivated to bring you more content like this now let's get back to the tutorial and now i will be just uh, using my this widget basically backdrop filter which will be backdrop filter and i will be just using my this image filter dot blur and i will be just adding sigma to sigma x to 100 and then i'll be just also adding sigma uh, y 200 you can just adjust the blur by just reducing these values so i'll be just going to 100 and and then in the child part i'll be just using a simple container and then i will just save this and you will see a blurry effect on your background of uh, your interface and there you have it a fantastic flatter user interface with a blur effect that can really make your applications stand out feel free to customize and experiment with the code to match your application's theme and style if you enjoyed this tutorial don't forget to give it a thumbs up and share it with your fellow developers for more flutter content make sure to subscribe to our channel all right uh, before we wrap up make sure to follow me on instagram facebook join our whatsapp group and also follow our whatsapp channel for more updates contact uh, connect with me on linkedin as well and as always stay fit stay healthy and i'll see you in the next tutorial until then happy fluttering